a limited access road, known by various terms worldwide, including limited access highway, dual carriageway, expressway, and partial controlled access highway, is a highway or arterial road for high speed traffic which has many or most characteristics of a controlled access highway, freeway or motorway, including limited or no access to adjacent property, some degree of separation of opposing traffic flow, use of grade separated interchanges to some extent, prohibition of some modes of transport such as bicycles or horses, and very few or no intersecting cross streets. The degree of isolation from local traffic allowed varies between countries and regions. The precise definition of these terms varies by jurisdiction. History The first implementation of limited access roadways in the United States was the Bronx River Parkway in New York, in 1907. The New York State Parkway system was constructed as a network of high-speed roads in and around New York City. The first limited access highway built is thought to be the privately built Long Island Motor Parkway in Long Island, New York. The Southern State Parkway opened in 1927, while the Long Island Motor Parkway was closed in 1937 and replaced by the Northern State Parkway opened in 1931 and the contiguous Grand Central Parkway opened in 1936. Topic. Regional implementations In the United States, the National Manual on Uniform Traffic Control Devices MUTCD uses full control of access only for freeways. Expressways are defined as having partial control of access or semi-controlled access, meaning that major roads typically use interchanges and commercial development is accessed via cross roads or frontage roads, while minor roads can cross at grade and farms can have direct access. This definition is also used by some states, some of which also restrict freeways only to motor vehicles capable of maintaining a certain speed. Some other states use controlled access to mean a higher standard than limited access, while others reverse the two terms. Topic. Oceania Topic. Australia While Australia's larger capital cities feature controlled access highway networks, the smaller metropolitan areas mostly rely on limited access highways for high-speed local traffic. In South Australia the terms expressway and freeway can be synonymous. The southern and northern expressways are both controlled access highways. However, perhaps confusingly, the Port River Expressway is a limited access highway. Dual carriageways that connect capital cities and regional centres, such as the M31 Hume Highway between Sydney and Melbourne, are almost all limited access highways. In spite of this, freeway terminology is used on signage for most regional limited access highways in the state of Victoria. Topic. New Zealand, expressway, motorway The terms motorway and expressway in New Zealand both encompass multi-lane divided freeways as well as narrower two to four lane undivided expressways with varying degrees of grade separation, the difference being that in New Zealand a motorway has certain additional legal traffic restrictions. Topic. Asia. Topic. China The expressway network of the People's Republic of China is the longest highway system in the world. The network is also known as National Trunk Highway System NTHS. By the end of 2016, the total length of China's expressway network reached 131,000 kilometers 82,000 miles. Expressways in China are a fairly recent addition to a complex network of roads. China's first expressway was built in 1988. Until 1993, very few expressways existed. The network is expanding rapidly after 2000. In 2011, 11,000 kilometers 6, miles of expressways were added to the network. Topic. Pakistan 
The expressways of Pakistan are a network of multiple lane, high speed highways in Pakistan, which are owned, maintained, and operated federally by Pakistan's National Highway Authority. They are one class lower than the country's motorways and are usually upgraded versions of the national highways. The total length of Pakistan's expressways is 260 km 160 miles as of November, 2016. Around 770 km 480 miles of expressways are currently under construction in different parts of country. Most of these expressways will be complete between 2017 and 2020. Topic. Taiwan ROC. Expressways in Taiwan may be controlled access highways similar to national freeways or limited access roads. Most have provincial as opposed to national highway status, although some are built and maintained by cities. All provincial expressways run east-west except for provincial highway number 61, which runs north-south along the west coast. Some provincial expressway routes are still under construction. Topic. Malaysia, Lebaraya The North-South Expressway Utara covers the length of Peninsula Malaysia. It connects woodlands in Singapore to the Thailand border. Another expressway called the Karak Highway links Kuala Lumpur to Jabor. It covers almost the width of Peninsula Malaysia. There are many rest areas along both expressways. Both expressways has a speed limit from 90 km per hour to 110 km per hour. Topic. Singapore Singaporean expressways are used to get to one urban place to another. The longest is the Pan Island Expressway, which covers the width of Singapore. It is 42 kilometers long. Since 2009, even more expressways are being constructed. One of the newest is the Kalang Pai Labar Expressway which is 2 kilometers on ground level and 10 kilometers underground. That makes it the longest tunnel expressway in Southeast Asia. On ground level or on flyovers and viaducts, speed limits is 70 km per hour to 90 km per hour but in tunnels, the speed limit is 70 km per hour or 80 km per hour. Topic. India Expressways in India make up more than 942 kilometers, 585 miles of the Indian National Highway system on which they are the highest class of road. The National Highways Development Project is underway to add an additional 18,637 kilometers, 11,580 miles of expressways to the network by the year 2022. Topic: Iran Expressways in Iran are one class lower than freeways and are used in large urban areas such as Isfahan, Mashhad, or Tehran and between other important cities usually two province capitals in rural and desert areas. The speed limit in urban areas is between 50 and 70 km per hour and in rural and desert areas between 90 and 110 km per hour. Topic. Japan. The term expressway as used in English in Japan refers to both freeway-style highways and narrower, more winding, often undivided regional high-standard highways de yugao gui zhe dao lu. Both types of expressways have a combined length of 10,021 km as of April 2012. Topic. Sri Lanka Sri Lanka has ensured to classify the expressways in reference to the connotation of E-grades. As of 2014, three expressways namely the E01 Southern Expressway, E02 Outer Circular Expressway and the E03 Colombo, Katunayaka Expressway have been created. A tax levying structure is proposed for traveling via the expressways. Speed limits in the range of 80 to 100 km per hour is attested for traveling through the expressways. Up to now two expressways namely the Northern Expressway and the Ruwanpura Expressway are in process to satisfy the needs of public transport. Topic. South Korea 
Motorways in South Korea, literally motor car only road, includes various grades of highways other than expressways. Contrary to the expressway in South Korea, motorway is a measure of traffic control, rather than a class of the road. For example, Jeu Ro is a segment of the National Route 77 as well as a motorway. As of June 2011, 1,610 kilometers of highways in total were designated as motorways, 1,052 kilometers national highways, 351 kilometers metropolitan highways, 185 kilometers regional highways and 20 kilometers municipal highways. Like expressways, motorcycles are not permitted. Topic. Europe. Topic. Austria, Schnellstrasse In Austria the speed limit on a Schnellstrasse is 100 to 130 km per hour. Schnellstrain are very similar to Austrian Autobahnen freeways, motorways, the chief difference is that they are more cheaply built with smaller curve radius, often undivided and have fewer bridges and tunnels. Topic. Belgium, Auto Vague. Further information, Belgium Highway Code In Belgium an auto vague is a public road, the beginning of which is indicated by the first signboard F9 and the end by the second sign F11. An important difference with an autosnell vague is that crossroads as well as traffic lights can be on an auto vague. In Belgium there is no specific speed regulation for an auto vague. Only motor vehicles and the trailers, with the exception of mopeds, agricultural vehicles and the towing of fairground vehicles, as well as four-wheelers without passenger compartment, are allowed to drive on an auto vague. An auto vague can consist of two or more lanes. The driving directions can be separated by a road marking, or by a central reservation. If a public road autosnell vague, auto vague, vague, consists of two or more lanes that are clearly separated from each other by a roadside or a space that is not accessible to vehicles, the drivers may not drive on the lane opposite to them. Topic. Croatia Some expressways are tailored for local traffic, such as the D28 VR Bovec Expressway, and some are built as bypasses or beltways, such as the D31 East Velika Gorica Bypass. Croatia also has a large network of tolled highways for transit traffic with a higher speed limit than expressways. Both highways and expressways are grade separated throughout their entire length. Topic. Czech Republic, Ryklosny Silnis Expressways in the Czech Republic, Czech, Ryklosny Silnis abbreviation, R, are defined as dual carriageways with smaller emergency lane. The speed limit is 130 km per hour 80 miles per hour. Expressway road signs are white on blue. There are 391.2 km of Ryklosny Silnis. Topic. Denmark. Motortrafik vi. In Denmark, a motortrafik vi, Danish for motor traffic road, is a high-speed highway with a speed limit between 80 to 90 km per hour. The most common motortrafik vi has two lanes, one plus one or two plus one. There is no grade intersections. The signs for motortrafik vi have white text on blue background. Topic. Finland, Mutariliakeniti In Finland, highways are separated into three categories, all access valteti, main road, limited access Mutariliakeniti, motor traffic road, and finally Mutoriti, motorway. The latter two are marked with green signage, while valteti signage is blue. While most of the network is all-access road, 779 km of it is motorway, and 124 km is limited access road. The access is limited to motor vehicles faster than 50 km per hour, thus excluding pedestrian, bicycle, moped or tractor traffic. Furthermore, towing is not allowed. Limited access roads are generally similar to motorways, but do not fulfill all the technical requirements, such as several lanes in one direction or separation of opposite directions. 
Limited access roads are usually built because the local population density is too low to justify a motorway. Often space has been left during construction for an eventual upgrade to a motorway. Limited access roads also function as feeder routes for motorways. The general speed limit on main roads and limited access roads is 100 km per hour summertime and 80 km per hour wintertime. On motorways the speed limits are 120 and 100 km per hour respectively. Especially during winter the speed limits can be changed due to weather conditions. Topic. Germany, Kraftfahrstrasse A Kraftfahrstrasse, German for motor power road, also colloquially called Schnellstrasse, literally, fast road, in Germany is any road with access limited to motor vehicles with a maximum design speed of more than 60 km per hour, 37 miles per hour excluding pedestrian, bicycle, moped or tractor traffic. Oversized vehicles are banned. The construction of transregional Kraftfahrstrain highways Autostrain rank below the standard of German autobahns. With regard to the general German speed limits, on roads with lanes separated by a median or with a minimum of two marked lanes per direction, an advisory speed limit of 130 km per hour 81 miles per hour applies. At grade intersections are admissible, regulation at junctions is usually provided by traffic lights or roundabouts. U-turns and any deliberate stopping are prohibited. Kraftfahrs train are out of bounds to pedestrians, except for special crosswalks. Topic: Hungary Autot. Expressways in Hungary are called Autot (auto car road). They are mostly dual carriageways. The main difference between Hungarian motorways and expressways is, that they are more cheaply built with narrower width and often undivided. Maximum speed limit is reduced to 110 km per hour for vehicles under 3.5 tons, and 70 km per hour for vehicles over 3.5 tons. In Hungary there are multiple types of dual carriageways. One part is almost identical with motorways, but the driving lanes are narrower. Parameters of a 2 plus 2 lane dual carriageway off habitat area Total width of road, 25.60 meters Driving lane width, 3.50 meters Pavement width, 2 by 10.25 meters Parking lane, 3.00 meters Middle separation area width, 3.60 m Parameters of a 2 plus 2 lane dual carriageway in habitat town, city, area Total width of road, 24.10 meters. Driving lane width, 3.50 meters. Pavement width, 2 by 10.75 meters. Parking lane, 3.00 meters. Middle separation area width, 3.60 m. There are also semi motorways with only one side of the motorway built. After the missing lanes are built, they will become standard motorways. Topic. Ireland, HQDC A high-quality dual carriageway HQDC in Ireland is normally completed to a motorway standard, including no right turns, but with no motorway restrictions. These are common on the final stretches of motorways nearing a major city, generally in order to enable use of bus stops and city bus services on the particular stretch of road. There are not yet any specific signs for this type of road, but the National Roads Authority have hinted that they are looking at implementing the German-style Autostrasse sign in Ireland. Speed limits are normally 100 km per hour compared to 120 km per hour on motorways. Topic. Italy, Superstrada In Italy there are Type B Highway or Strada Extraurbana Principale, commonly but unofficially known as Superstrada, is a divided highway with at least two lanes for each direction, paved shoulder on the right, no cross traffic and no at grade intersections. Access restrictions on such highways are exactly the same of Italian motorways autostrade, as well as signage at the beginning and the end of the highway, with the only difference being the background color, blue instead of green. Speed limit on Type B road is 110 km per hour. Type C Highway or Strada Extraurbana Secondaria, a single carriageway with at least one lane for each direction and shoulders. 
It may have at grade, at level crossings with railways, roundabouts and traffic lights. This category contains also dual carriageways that cannot be classified as Type B highways because of the lack of one or more required features. In absence of specific regulation signs, a Type C road is accessible by all vehicles and pedestrians, even if it has separate carriageways and no cross traffic. The sign shown here on the left allows access only to motorized vehicles. Speed limit on Type C roads is 90 km per hour. Topic. Netherlands, auto vague The Netherlands has much more kilometers of motorways Snelwegen, than expressways Autowegen. The latter only form a complementary part of the country's main highway network. They are typically shorter than motorways, offering connections of a more regional significance. The general speed limit is 100 km per hour. Only faster motor vehicles, both capable and legally allowed to go at least 50 km per hour, may use the road. Autowagen always numbered and mostly signposted with an N for non-motorway highway and up to three digits, like N34. For the most part they fall under national or provincial management. Dutch expressways are built to significantly varying standards. Designs range from fully controlled access dual carriageways with grade separation, center dividers and full hard shoulders, to single carriageways with just one lane per direction and only intermittent shoulder patches called Vlicht Havens small lay BYS. Intersections are frequently at grade with traffic lights, or they are roundabouts. Although there are never level railway crossings, there can be movable bridges in these roads. In either case, the speed limit is frequently reduced to 70 km per hour before reaching the junction or the bridge. Since 1997 a national traffic safety program called Sustainable Safety has introduced a new road categorization and new design standards. Although Autowagen don't have to conform completely to the new Dutch design standard for regional flow roads Strumwagen, many of these roads require at least some upgrades. The ideal is to make expressways divided and grade separated, as much as possible. Otherwise these roads are downgraded to the safety category of distributor roads, thereby losing their expressway status. Topic. Norway, Motortrafikve In Norway, a Motortrafikve Norwegian for motor traffic road, formerly called Motorvei Klasse B. Class B motorway is a high-speed highway with a speed limit of up to 90 km per hour. There are no at-grade intersections. Direction signs for Motortrafikve have black text on yellow background, while same signs on Motorvei have white text on blue background. As of October 2017 the Norwegian road database show approximately 455 km of Motortrafikve in Norway. Topic. Poland, Droga Expressoa Droga Expressoa plural, Drogi Expresso, in Poland refers to a network of roads fulfilling the role of bringing traffic to the motorways, and serving major international and inter-regional purposes. They are often built as ring roads since they take less space than motorway and allow more entrances and exits. All expressways start with the letter S, followed by a number. They can be dual or single carriageways and have reduced number of one-level intersections. As of May 2004 the Polish government documents indicated that the country had plans of an expressway and motorway network totaling 7,200 km 4, miles, including about 2,000 km 1, miles of motorways. The speed limit is 120 km per hour dual carriageway and 100 km per hour single carriageway. Topic. Portugal, via Rapida In Portugal, a non-motorway limited access road is commonly referred as a via Rapida rapid way, plural, vias rapidus, although there is not a specific official technical designation for it. The legal term via Reservada Automoveis e Motorcyclis reserved way for automobiles and motorcycles is used to designate a non-motorway road where motorway rules apply except the speed limit which is lower. However, this term refers only to the road rules and not to the road technical characteristics. There are two main types of roads commonly referred as vias rapidus in Portugal. 
The first type is a limited access road, with dual carriageway and with interchanges grade separation. Many of these roads have all or almost all the technical characteristics of full motorways. Examples are the several urban highways in cities like Lisbon, Oporto, Coimbra and Braga. In Madeira, the main regional highways, that connect the cities and other important places of the island, are mainly of these type. There are two vias rapidus classified as motorways in the region, VR1 and VR2. The second Portuguese type of via rapida is a highway with all the same characteristics of the above first type, except the number of carriageways that is only one. Examples of this type of roads are the ancient IP4 and IP5 before being transformed in full motorways, the Portaliga Beja section of the IP2, the Coimbra Visu section of the IP3 and several complementary routes IC. The dual carriageway Vias Rapidus can be classified and signalized as reserved ways for automobiles and motorcycles, cases in which general motorway rules apply, except speed limited which is never above 100 km per hour. In dual carriageway Vias Rapidus not signalized as reserved ways, normal road rules apply, including speed limit which is never above 90 km per hour. Single carriageway Vias Rapidus cannot be classified and signalized as reserved ways and so normal road rules always apply there. Topic. Romania Planned expressways according to CNADNR Romanian National Company of Motorways and National Roads topic. Russia Russia has a large federal highway network that totals approximately 30,000 km 18,640 miles. Federal highways in the country are classified into two categories. Motorways. Russian, Magistralinar Avtomobilinar Daroga Avtomagistral not the same as the English term motorway, and other. Topic. Spain, Autovia. Unlike Spain's autopistas, specifically reserved for vehicles able to sustain at least 60 km per hour 37 miles per hour, and usually tolled, autovias are usually upgrades from older roads, and never toll roads. In general, slow vehicles like bicycles and agricultural machinery are allowed under certain restrictions. Topic. Sweden The Swedish road type Motortrafikald is a road with limited access all grade separated, no slow traffic and two or three lanes. According to the EU's multilingual term base, Motortrafikald should be translated to expressway, rapid road or road with limited access. The same rules apply to a Motortrafikald as to a motorway, it is basically a half motorway. The speed limit is usually 90 to 100 km per hour. Many motortrafiklider are built as two plus one roads, alternating two lanes in one direction and one in the other, with a narrow fence in between. Topic. Switzerland In Switzerland Autostrasse, German, auto road, semi-autoroute, or semi-autostrade, French and Italian for semi-freeway is a highway that is only allowed to high-speed traffic with no crossings, but it is not the highest class road, the motorways Autobahn, Autoroute, Autostrada. The speed limit on these roads in Switzerland is 100 km per hour 62 miles per hour. Most of the Autostrasse, semi-autoroutes, semi-autostrade have no central barrier separating the lanes in different directions. Topic. United Kingdom. In the United Kingdom, the second tier of high-speed roads below motorways are typically dual carriageways. Many roads such as the A1, the A14, the A19 and the A42 are built to a high quality, in many places they are only intersected by grade-separated junctions, have full barriers at both the roadside and the central reservations and in some cases three lanes of traffic, however for at least one reason they fall short of motorway standard. They may lack some features that a motorway would have, such as hard shoulders, and may have tighter bends and steeper gradients than would be allowed on a motorway or have established rights of way that cannot be removed. 
the standard motorway speed limit for cars of 70 miles per hour (113 kilometers per hour) also applies to many dual carriageways. In March 2015, it was announced that a new standard would be developed to formally designate certain high-quality routes in England as expressways. Topic: North America. Topic: Canada. In Ontario, expressway is synonymous with freeway and is used to mean limited access divided highways with no at-grade intersections, with both terms used interchangeably. An example of this is the Gardiner Expressway through Western and Downtown Toronto, and once it turns into a six-lane arterial road Lakeshore Boulevard east of the Don River, there is a sign warning of the end of the freeway. The EC Row Expressway in Windsor, Ontario is a controlled access divided freeway with grade separated interchanges, between Ojibwe Parkway at its western terminus and Banwell Road at its eastern terminus, where there are traffic intersections at both termini. The McDonald Cartier Freeway would be an example of a route that uses the term freeway, however, that name is being phased out by the Ministry of Transportation. In general, the term expressway is used more frequently for municipally maintained roads, while provincial freeways are known more by their route number particularly the 400 series highways are known as Highway 4 underscore underscore, despite some of them having an expressway name for all or part of their length, such as the Chedoke Expressway, Hamilton Expressway, Belfield Expressway, and Airport Expressway. The Veterans Memorial Parkway in London, Ontario, has intersections instead of interchanges, and thus is considered an expressway and not a freeway. It was originally designed with sufficient right-of-way to be built as a full freeway, but a lack of funding forced it to be built with at-grade intersections. Similarly, the Hanlon Parkway in Guelph and Highway 40 in Sarnia, Ontario were originally opened with intersections in lieu of interchanges, save for the couple grade separated interchanges. Regional Road 420 in Niagara Falls is also an expressway. While Allen Road and Highway 400 were originally full freeways, their extensions for Allen Road to meet Shepherd Avenue and Dufferin Street, and the 400 South extension which became Black Creek Drive and handed over to Metro Toronto upon completion were built as expressways with at-grade intersections. Two sections of Highway 11, between Barry and Aurelia as well as between Aurelia and Gravenhurst, are a right-in right-out expressway rather than a full freeway. The southern portion of Highway 35 is also a Rero Expressway. In most of Western Canada, an expressway is a high-speed arterial road along the lines of the California definition, while a freeway is fully controlled access with no at-grade intersections. In Alberta, the term trail refers to both full freeways stony trail, or high-speed arterials with a mix of signalized intersections and interchanges Crowchild trail. The Yellowhead Trail as it passes through Edmonton, Alberta has both intersections and interchanges. It is the main east-west artery for the northern half of the city. There are plans to upgrade many of the most congested remaining intersections into interchanges in the near future. In Quebec, the term freeway is never used, with the terms expressway in English and autoroute in English and French being preferred. English terms are rare, and only found on bilingual signage of expressways abbreviated XB. Found in Montreal around bridges and on the Bonaventure Expressway, these signs are controlled by the federal government. Most of the autoroutes are built or at least designed to be upgraded to a full freeway initially constructed as a two-lane expressway. A notable exception is the section of Autoroute 20 through Vaudreuil Dorian and Lyle Perrot which is an 8 km urban boulevard. Topic. United States In the United States, an expressway is defined by the federal government's Manual on Uniform Traffic Control Devices as a divided highway with partial control of access. In contrast, a freeway is defined as a divided highway with full control of access. The difference between partial and full access control is that expressways may have a limited number of driveways and at-grade intersections, thus making them a form of high-speed arterial road, while access to freeways is allowed only at grade separated interchanges. Expressways under this definition do not conform to interstate highway standards which ban all driveways and at-grade intersections and are therefore usually numbered as state highways or U.S. highways. This distinction was first developed in 1949 by the Special Committee on Nomenclature of what is now the American Association of State Highway and Transportation Officials AASHTO. 
In turn, the definitions were incorporated into AASHTO's official standards book, the Manual on Uniform Traffic Control Devices, which would become the National Standards Book of the U.S. Department of Transportation under a 1966 federal statute. The same distinction has also been codified into the statutory law of eight states, California, Minnesota, Mississippi, Missouri, Nebraska, North Dakota, Ohio, and Wisconsin. However, each state codified the federal distinction slightly differently. California expressways do not necessarily have to be divided, though they must have at least partial access control. For both terms to apply in Wisconsin, a divided highway must be at least four lanes wide. In Missouri, both terms apply only to divided highways at least 10 miles long that are not part of the interstate highway system. In North Dakota and Mississippi, an expressway may have full or partial access control and generally has grade separations at intersections. A freeway is then defined as an expressway with full access control. Ohio's statute is similar, but instead of the vague word generally, it imposes a requirement that 50% of an expressway's intersections must be grade separated for the term to apply. Only Minnesota enacted the exact MUTCD definitions in May 2008. However, many states around the Great Lakes region and along the eastern seaboard have refused to conform their terminology to the federal definition. The following states officially prefer the term expressway instead of freeway to describe what are technically freeways in federal parlance, Connecticut, Florida, Illinois, Maryland, and West Virginia. In those states, it is common to find interstate highways that bear the name expressway. Ultimately, it is the federal definition that defines a road's classification whether it is an expressway or freeway no matter the preferred term. No state, for instance, could have what is technically an expressway given interstate status just because semantically they use the term interchangeably with freeway. Most expressways under the federal definition have speed limits of 45 to 55 miles per hour, 70 to 90 kilometers per hour in urban areas and 55 to 70 miles per hour, 90 to 110 kilometers per hour in rural areas. Urban expressways are usually free of private driveways, but occasional exceptions include direct driveways to gas stations and shopping malls at major intersections, which would never be allowed on a true freeway. The vast majority of expressways are built by state governments, or by private companies, which then operate them as toll roads pursuant to a license from the state government. A famous example of a local government getting into the expressway business is Santa Clara County in California, which deliberately built its own expressway system in the 1960s to supplement the freeway system then planned by Caltrans. Although the county originally planned to upgrade the expressways into full-fledged freeways, such a project became politically infeasible after the rise of the tax revolt movement in the mid-1970s, which began with California Proposition 13 in 1978. South America Brazil. In Brazil, an expressway is known as Via Expressa and its function is to connect the most important streets and avenues of certain cities with their adjacent highways. Because of this, some expressways are numbered in the same way as highways. According to the Código Brasileiro de Trânsito, Brazilian Traffic Code, expressways are officially defined as vias de trânsito rápido, rapid transit routes, and are considered the most important urban roads with standard speed limits of 80 kilometers per hour unless specified. A few examples of expressways include Marginal Tietê and Marginal Paneros in São Paulo, Avenida Brasil, Red Line and Yellow Line in Rio de Janeiro, among others. Topic. See also Supercorridor